So it's the Spotlight's birthday, and because Nick is such a great co-host, I thought I'd throw him a surprise party. It's going to be awesome. Okay, so I got this great idea. I'm going to surprise Becca on our Spotlight birthday episode. She's going to have no idea. I spent all morning cooking these cupcakes. It's going to be so great. I'm so excited. Oh. Welcome to a very special birthday edition <laughs> of the Spotlight. I'm your host, Nick Candela. And I'm Becca Friedman. We've got a great show lined up for you this time. We got our hats yep, on. We're all we ready. Got, the set is decked out. <laughs> and we had such a great year. Over 50 episodes. Oh, now. I know. It's crazy. I can't believe we've done that many. I know. And we've got, a, again, a great episode lined up for you. We're going to be seeing highlights from the entire season. Yeah, these are our favorite episodes, I think, are our birthday ones. We always have lots of fun looking oh, yeah. back at the past year. But without further ado, let's check out some of the past entertainers that we've had on. I know we've talked about the fans already a little bit, but put in perspective exactly what kind of atmosphere they provide down there. So when you come to a game, it's like nothing you've ever been to. Yeah, and I want to be clear to the audience that like you don't have to be with our supporters. Um, <laughs> right. <laughs> there's two sections of the stadium. There's the supporters who, you know, they'll meet up a couple hours beforehand at a neighboring bar in the cast corridor and they'll march in unison, a few hundred strong, into the stadium with their drums and their, you know, smoke bombs and their flags and their <laughs> noisemakers and then they get into the stands and they stand the entire game and they sing and you know they have their chants some are pretty blue others are you know family friendly but most are pretty blue right and, uh, <laughs> but they're on the other side of the stadium and everybody else families and everybody can be on the other side and watch from afar and take in the spectacle and uh, you know and the field is very uh, small and so you're right on top of the action I mean it's pretty it's a very lively atmosphere Our show is the High Flying Dog Variety Show. You'll see high speed agility racers, you'll see high flying frisbee dogs, and a whole lot of family fun. You got the burgundy and green shark logo, Royal Impact t-shirt with the Washington Redskin hat, with the skateboard, the skateboard look. So this is something we wear in spring and the summertime, so our I look for that. Okay, now tell me a little bit about that logo. What's the significance of the shark logo? The shark is just it's a friendly shark. It's basically, we, the shark is a symbol of I smell blood, but in a good way, which basically means in life we can, if we can see it, we can do it. If we can smell it, we can do it. It's just a positive way to reconstruct the shark. And you see the shark is smiling. And so it's just a positive way to reconstruct everything. Hopeless 
Smoke Harvest is an event happening at the Victory Inn here in Warren, and it's a, it's a local charity event. Uh, things are going to a company called Blum's Landing, which is a northern Michigan charity uh, that sends veterans on vacation with their families. So uh, November is uh, it's Vets uh, Family Month, so we thought it would be a good idea to get involved and get the community involved out here. Uh, uh, the Acoustic Guitar Project is basically a celebration of songwriting. Okay. Uh, the way it works is I get a used acoustic guitar, a little handheld microphone, I take it to a city and I give it to a musician. They have one week to record an original song using just that guitar and the mic. They can't edit it on the computer at all. It's got to be a live take. Okay. When they're done, they sign the guitar, they take a picture with it, and we do a video segment about that musician, post it all online, and then it goes on to the next musician. We do 12 musicians, and then we have a concert, and that's it. That sounds pretty amazing. I don't mean to ruin Christmas this way, but your cooking is terrible. You know, I learned from the best. Your mom. Oh. My mom, <laughs> my mom was a saint. Yeah, she was also very... Perky. Perky. Of course she was. She was a five foot three firecracker. <laughs> Look at her, she's even jumping in the picture. I know, right before we took that picture, she said... Ow. Ow! Oh. Yeah. That must have been because... Her foot got stuck in the mouse trap. Her foot got stuck in that mouse trap. I know. I love that lady. Where's my present? <laughs> right here. Cl Shut your eyes. It's very uh, okay. Sneakily <laughs> hidden behind this Christmas tree. It's so sneakily hidden behind this Christmas tree, you would have never found it. Can I look now? Not yet. Oh man. I already unwrapped it, so it's more of a surprise when you open your eyes. Okay. You know, your surprises make me think. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> I love Christmas. What a Christmas mess. Okay, open your eyes. Ah, Merry Christmas. Uh, you don't like it? No, it's not that I don't like it. I just really don't. Uh, 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 <laughs> what? You well, you're going to, you are actually putting your instruction skills to use. Uh, we have our lovely assistant, Rebecca Friedman. If she would like to come up here. Uh, you ready, Rebecca? I don't know, we'll see. Uh, we had a, a little bit of rehearsal. Um, yeah. Some went well, most did not. Yeah. Um, but we're going to put your instruction skills to use here. Yes. And we're going to do a little mini performance here, something a little out of the yes. ordinary. Just keep in mind, so I'm would, not very good at this, new to this. So. Okay, well, what we're going to do here is I'm going to get out of the way and spot so yes. nobody gets hurt. Spotting's very important. And yeah, I'm going to let you do what you do. All right. Ready? Rebecca is going to learn okay. how to stand right. on thighs. There we go. And Nick's going to spot. And the important role spot. of a spotter is to be right there behind her full body. Not ready just ready to catch right. me. Gotcha. Yeah, just in case. All right, Rebecca, are you ready? I am. Are you All right. ready? <laughs> I'm ready. We're going to take wrist to wrist grip, right. and I'm going to have you put one foot right here on my thigh. Okay. And when you stand up, I'd like you to stand straight up, push your hips forward, pull your shoulders back, and engage your arms. Okay. And then when you're up there, you can place the second foot. All right. Ready? Don't laugh too hard, people. Laugh, <laughs> laugh, really, <laughs> laugh really hard, because that's what we're about. Go All ahead right. and step one foot up. Good. And you're going to stand straight up to the ceiling. Okay. Ready? One, two, down, up. Good. She's up. Oh, oh, right. yeah. She's down. Okay, right, one more time. Second try. Second try. <laughs> Ready? Okay. One, two, down, up. Stand straight up. Hips forward. Oh. Ah. Hips forward. <laughs> Good. And we How did about it. if you release this arm? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, Rebecca Friedman, <laughs> the circus performer, not just a co host of Spotlight. <laughs> i
sound silly for me to think childish thoughts like these. Well, I'm so tired of acting tough, and I'm going to do what I please. Let's get married. I hope you liked the highlights so far. There's plenty more coming up after the break, so stick around. More birthday edition of the Spotlight coming right up.